So what kind of letters do we know? I mean, no, it's and then L and O. Hi everyone. I just wanted to make a quick little video of an intro to myself so you guys could get to know me a little bit. My name is Agnes, but everybody calls me Aggie. Um, I'm 23 years old and I have two little boys. I have a 3 year old and a 10 month old and they grow up so fast. I cannot believe my little baby is almost one and my big boy is almost four. Time flies so fast. We're a family of four. It's me, my boyfriend John, and then our kids, Hunter and Paxton. Uh, we live in Chicago, Illinois, and it's not our ideal place to live, but for certain circumstances, this is where we live. I did not plan on having kids this young. Um, but I can't complain. I love being a mom. I'm actually a stay-at-home mom, so I'm with them all the time, every day, all day. And we love to have fun. We love to play. We love to learn. Um, I do a lot of learning activities with my three-year-old, as well as my 10-month-old. But he just likes to throw things and have fun his own way, which is perfectly fine. Before I was a mom, I, after I graduated high school, I did go to college for a little bit, and then I found out that I was pregnant with my first son, and I was going to continue to go to school, but I had really bad morning sickness, and I just could not get out of bed, and it was all day practically every day until the third trimester but it was obviously too late to continue my classes by the third trimester so I did drop out but I did go back to start again and continue my schooling after I had my son it was a little setback for me but it was okay and then we had to move so I dropped out again, but then when we moved back to the area, I went, I, I went back to school and my son actually came with me and went to the daycare at the college. So it was a little fun thing for us, for him to get ready for his school and go play with his friends. So while I was um, juggling being a mom and a full-time student, I found a job at a daycare and I worked there for maybe six months, six to seven months, and um, I had to leave my little guy at home with my mom while I went to work, but we still had the morning together and then we talked about his day at school, and then I dropped him off and I went to work. Um, Shortly after that, I found out that I was pregnant with my second son, and I finished off the semester that I was in, but then we had to move again, so that's when we moved to Chicago. We'll talk about dad for a little bit. Their dad's name is John. I've been with him for four years now. We didn't plan on having kids right away. But it ended up being, I got pregnant with our first son three months into our relationship. I love the guy. He's very fun and goofy. And he's a great dad. Um, he currently works um, an hour away. So And he's gone all weekend. He leaves Fridays and he comes back on Sundays. But he also works during the week a little bit. So, when I was pregnant with my second son, I really thought it was going to be a girl. 
And so I kind of told my firstborn that it was going to be a girl, hopefully. So he was excited for a sister, but then he got surprised with the brother when we went to reveal the gender. Um, so since then, he's been really wanting a little sister. And I do plan on trying at least one more time. We're hoping for a girl, and then we're going to stop having kids because three is enough for us. But that won't be for a while. I think I'll wait maybe three years or so to have another baby um, because these two are a handful as it is. I would like to introduce my two sons to you. Um, so first, we will show my oldest, my three-year-old Hunter. So this is Hunter. He is, how old are you? Can you hold up your fingers? How old are you? Are you this many? No. Are you this many? No. Are you this many? Yeah, three. He is three years old. His birthday is in May. So almost four. So that was Hunter. He wanted to do a little bit by himself. I think it made him feel a little more comfortable. Um, but he showed you some of his little toys. And it seemed like he was having a little bit of fun. He's a really goofy and interesting little boy. And I love spending every day with him. Because things get a little interesting with the conversations we have. Um, he loves cars and trucks and he loves dinosaurs. Uh, we actually recently went to the Field Museum to see the dinosaurs. And that was fun, right? Yeah. Um, this is his best friend, Doggy. I think Doggy needs a bath, huh? Only a head. Only his head? Yeah. Well, you take him around everywhere, right? Right outside, I do bye-bye, and on this house. Yeah. Hmm. We take Doggy everywhere because he cannot leave without it. And that's okay. So, we like to play, right? And learn. We learn our letters, right? So what kind of letters do we know? I mean, no, it's and B and L and O and. You know a lot of letters. Yeah. What letter does your name start with? Um. What letter does Hunter start with? That's my name. 
What? Not number, you silly. What letter? What letter is your name? Letter H is Hunter. What letter is Paxton? P -p 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 Paxton. P. P. Good job. Can you wave? Yay. Are you ready to go to school soon? No. You don't want to go on the big school bus? Oh, you want to go now? Well, you're still a little too young. I guess you could go to preschool, but we can't do that right now. Maybe next year you could go to preschool. I hope so. I uh, bus took me a month home. Yeah, the bus will take you to the school and then bring you back home. All right, well, can you wave bye? Can you say bye, everybody? Say bye. introduce you to my little guy, Paxton. Alright, ready, buddy? Are you ready? <laughs> Alright, this is Paxton. Say hi. Hello. I need to teach him. There you go. He is 10 months old. And he is very interested in learning how to walk. So he is walking everywhere and he's such a fast crawler and a very bouncy baby. <laughs> you got the cow? You got the cow? <laughs> um, I cannot believe he's almost one. It went by so fast. So he's not really willing to eat table food, and he wasn't really willing to eat baby food either. Um, he's just obsessed with the breast. He loves his breast milk. Hi, Paxton. Can you say hi? Say hi. Say hi. Hello. Um, he gets super excited about things, as you can see. He would like to go play with his brother now. Right. He is a little um, picky when it comes to eating. He's not really open to trying table foods yet, which I wish he was because then he would be more full. But he constantly breastfeeds, which is okay because he gets nutrients and vitamins from that. He's also very picky of which way he breastfeeds. It's always changing and it's a little difficult keeping up with him sometimes. He did not like any of the baby food um, that they have in the stores. Um, he will eat the little snacks sometimes, like the little puffs, or he's tried the rice husks and the little like lunches or dinners like with pasta and stuff and veggies he'll try those but he only eats like two or three bites and then he's done he loses I interest i just in can't it. believe how fast time flies watching them grow and learn it's just it's just amazing i love every day with them and i am a stay-at-home mom so i get to see everything that happens you will be seeing some more of them throughout the videos that I will be posting and I hope you like them and comment and subscribe so I hope you learned a little bit about me and a little bit about my boys um, 
I'm sorry their dad couldn't be here as it is Saturday today and he is away at work but if you guys have any questions for us I will gladly answer anything just leave a comment down below and I'll get back to you about it I'm also maybe thinking about doing a little Q&A video um, if I get enough questions so just shoot a question or a comment down below whatever you would like please like and subscribe my video I hope you enjoyed meeting my two crazy little boys that I love so much